again with David Neal at the Murphy Museum. We have a another weird trailer. What is this one? Weird trailers are good. Yeah. Because weird trailers uh, appeal to people. Everyone has seen the Shasta, although those are wonderful to look at. This is a new moon car top camper. Mm -hmm. 1956, made in Alma, Michigan. Car top camper? If you dare, you can put this on top of your car because the cars back then had gutter rails. Ah, uh, yes. And this has clamps that clamp on the gutter rails, mm -hmm. so it's five feet off the ground, mm -hmm. and there's a ladder in there, and you pull out, and you shinny up the ladder. They're so full of nooks and crannies, like like uh, like English muffins. Yes. And it, when it pulls out, it has a front porch, believe it or not. Wow. It has a front door, and it has uh, four bunk beds. doesn't have a kitchen, but you do the cooking on and the ground. And does it stay on top of the car? It stays on top of so the car. So you have a ladder that goes up the side? All the time, it stays on top of the car, until summertime's over, then it goes in your garage or uh, And how big a car does. would you need to have? Oh, any kind of car, like a four-door car or a station wagon. Something with a flat top. Something with a flat top, but it has to have gutter rails or else mm -hmm. it won't work. Mm -hmm. Now, you could also put it on a flat trailer. Mm -hmm. uh, all of that was not as common. We do that here because modern cars don't have gutter rails anymore. Right. So we put it on a trailer so we can wheel it around. So you put a trailer on top of a trailer? You can put a trailer on top of a trailer. Yeah, very, very clever. So you're getting good at this game. Good for you. In this compartment, you would open this compartment and there was a ladder that, that would pull out and the ladder just clamps onto here. Remember, this of course is on top of the car. And so the family goes up the ladder and then they go onto this front porch right here. They open the door and then we have displayed here at the, at the museum, we have it displayed with the four bunk beds. So two here and two on the opposite side underneath the bunk beds there's a place to actually put your clothing or your suitcases uh what have you so it's really really nice and then the sides come down like this we're showing the side without the canvas so if you just wanted something uh, uh quick and take a nap but we also have canvas that snaps in and completely encapsulates the not side. really bear proof this isn't bear proof this isn't bear proof uh it's not smelly skunk proof so camper beware <laughs>